Paul O'Grady's funeral procession has touched the hearts of fans and friends alike, as mourners gathered to pay their respects to a TV legend today. It comes after the Lily Savage icon died of a sudden cardiac arrhythmia at the age of 67 at his home in Aldington near Ashford on March 28. The canine-loving star's poignant procession saw many dogs from his beloved charity, Battersea Dogs and Cats Home, gather along the street wearing their iconic blue jackets. The sweet tribute was organized in order to celebrate the love the TV favorite had for his furry friends, something which was well documented in his ITV show for the love of dogs. Mourners appeared with their pets, as the Battersea staff gathered along the procession route with their animal residents. The community funeral had been organized by one of his lifelong fans in the local area, Janine Ferguson, to pay tribute to his animal-loving tendencies. The aim was to raise money for animal charities, something which was already ongoing following the fund set up by Battersea Dogs and Cats Home recently. The charity initiative won over the hearts of fans of the National Treasure and ultimately netted the charity an impressive £270,000. Paul, who'd been an ambassador for the charity, had often spoken of his affection for animals. On one occasion, talking of his farm life in Kent, he chuckled to The Guardian, I've got six pigs, three goats six barn owls, three chickens, four dogs and six sheep. I am not bothered about sex, money or fame, I just want a mongoose. Meanwhile, in an ITV interview pre-recorded before his death, he admitted that it was always such a joy to pay a visit to the Battersea charity. A supporter for over a decade, he joked that he now felt like he was part of the furniture and that the venue was as close to him as a second home. Paul had described his For the Love of Dogs series as being like a Cinderella story and emotionally described how some traumatized strays or abandoned pets had literally been shaking with fear when he first encountered them. He took pride in gently regaining their confidence and mending their shattered nerves until they could trust humans again and be rehomed. The big-hearted star once declared, sadly not every dog can have a happy ending but to make this program is a privilege, even when it means rolling around on the floor of the kennels with the dogs all day. Today it was the dog's turn to honor Paul, and the crowds today were overcome with emotion as they stood amongst the beloved pets, 